I assembled this neck in August of last year. You can see me doing that here. Um, but then I just let it sit there while I finished the other guitar um, for the Great Guitar Build-Off of 2020. I found out that I cut my necks too skinny, so for the neck through body stuff, I'm gonna have to widen them out a little bit. And for that, I'm gonna add maple. This neck is made from uh, two pieces of wenge, sandwiching a strip of paduk. And on the outside, uh, you can see some maple strips there. I realized a bit late <laughs> that uh, they weren't white enough, so I went ahead and had to have some filler material there. In between the wenge and the mahogany pieces that make up the body. So, check out what I've been able to do yeah. in seven minutes' time. I'm going to use a sycamore cap, book matching it, and I'm planning on painting the top. Probably not the back, though. If you ever go down Trinidad, they make you feel so very glad. Calypso sing and make a cry. Look at all that beautiful red paduka. Coca-Cola, go down point Kumana. Both mother and daughter working for the Yankee dollar. Out on Monte Nello Beach, GI romance with native peach. All night long make tropic love. Hot sun and cool off. Drinking rum makes coca cola. Go down point Kumana. Both mother and daughter working for the Yankee dollar. In botanical gardens and afternoons, native bands play Yankee tunes. Native dance until he drops. Native blow his top, drinking rum and coca cola. Go down point Kumana, both mother and daughter working for the Yankee dollar. Gee, I meet nice native girl, give her great big courtship world. He married Trini, mommy, that's not bad. Trinidad dead, drinking rum and coca cola. Go down point Kumana, both mother and daughter working for the Yankee dollar. Native girl can cuddle rug, dance like crazy jitterbug. She jump and bump and shake so bold. That's fine way. Break up cold, drinking rum and coca cola. Go down point Kumana, both mother and daughter working for the Yankee dollar. All right, so I'm at a bit of an impasse here. I was going for kind of an open road, um, you know, classic car kind of feel here with this, and where I wanted to do um, like the passing lanes on the, the lower frets and at the higher frets would be like passing lane on the right side and then meet at the 12th fret. Um, but I realized that since the perspective showing it, the lower frets being farther apart it is totally weird when the inlays get longer. Uh, of course I could try to switch it around, but putting an inlay at the 24th fret, for example, or even the 21st fret, where it's only about this long, makes the ones that are really far apart really, really tiny, which is kind of just weird. So I don't think that's going to work with that idea. Here's some of the other ideas I had. 
kind of feel like the guitar has a bit of a classic car vibe going on with it. So maybe some emblems with my sh logo in it. Or it also has a bit of a Texas feel. So maybe something more like an outlaw thing like that. What kind of inlays do you think I should do for it? So it's getting pretty close to the end of the great guitar build off about two and a half months and until I have to be completely done with the guitar and uh, really cranking on the video to get it done and uploaded by the end of June. Uh, based on my historical performance on <laughs> building guitars, I think that's a bit short of time. What do you think? Do you think I should proceed with this and go ahead and try to complete it on time or um, just sit it out and wait for next time. I'd love to hear what your thoughts are. Please leave me a comment down below. Thanks for watching. Cheers.